Hundreds of exiled Tibetans in India marched today through New Delhi, hours ahead of Hu Jintao's visit to India, who is expected in India later in the evening for a four-day visit aimed to boost trade ties between the world's most populous nations. Tibetan nuns, monks and students, accompanied by activists from sympathetic organizations, carry posters of the Dalai Lama and chant slogans protesting the Chinese Communist regime in Tibet. Members of the Tibet Youth Congress, a group of thousands of young Tibetans, say they want to highlight Beijing's repressive policies in the region. We as a Tibetan, we know that there was a uh, Tibet, uh, India-Tibet border, but there was never a Sino-India border until that Tibet was occupied in 1949 that there exist a Sino-India border. So we completely denounced any kind of an agreement without the uh, presence of the Tibetan representative or without, uh, by sacrificing the Tibetan issue. Troops from the Chinese Communist regime marched into Tibet in 1950, and over the decades, Beijing has sought to modify traditional Tibetan society just as they have Chinese traditional culture. They've also closed monasteries and seriously restricted religious life. India recognizes Tibet as being part of China, but it provides asylum to tens of thousands of Tibetans.